Okay, in this lesson, we're going to find the determinant of the following matrix that you see there uh, using a different approach from the cofactor expansion. So this approach I call the diagonal line approach, and you'll see why I call it that later, okay? All right, so what we do, okay, we take, okay, write down the original matrix, and... And then what you're going to do is you're going to take the first two columns and put them to the right of the matrix. Okay. And so we're going to have one, two, zero here. Okay. And put the second column here, five, four, minus two. Okay. So now, what I do is I'm going to draw in these diagonal lines, okay? Get one here, one here, and another one here. Okay, and then I'm going to use a different color. So I have one here, one here, and one here, okay? All right, so along those diagonal lines, I'm gonna multiply those numbers, okay? So we have one times four times zero, okay? That's gonna give you zero. Uh, this is gonna be five negative one times zero, just zero. And then you have zero times two minus, uh, sorry, zero times two times negative two, which is zero, okay? Over here, okay, you're gonna get, again, zero, so, right? Um, you get one times negative one times negative two, so that will be two. Okay. Let me make a space for the sign there. So that's two. And then five times two times zero, which is gonna be zero. Okay, so for the for these values, okay, so you basically you take you take this, subtract it from this one, okay, so, okay, and that's gonna give you your determinant, okay, so we end up getting minus two plus zero, okay? So that is the, right, so therefore the determinant of A is minus two. Okay, so this only works for uh, three by three, it doesn't work for anything uh, larger than that, unfortunately. Um, I tried to derive a formula one time for something larger for like a four by four or five by five, and it got really messy. Um, so if somebody can come up with a general formula for that uh, using a similar approach to this, then um, that would be, you know, that would be a great accomplishment.